In this video I am telling you the amazing facts about Thailand you may not know. Thailand's official population is approximately the same as the United Kingdom. In the 2020 census, Thailand's population was recorded as 66.19 million. The UK's population in 2019 was 66.79 million, covering an area of 513,120 square kilometers. Thailand is a similar size to France and around twice the size of the United Kingdom. Thailand's coastline stretches for 2,815 kilometers which equates to 1,750 miles. Thailand's capital city, Bangkok, has one of the longest ceremonial names in the world. Made up of Pali and Sanskrit root words, Bangkok's real name is Krungthap Manikan Amonrat Anukasin Mahin Parathaya Mahadilok Papna Paratrachathan Ibera Ramudam Rachani Wit Mahusathan Amonfamana Watan Sathat Sakapati Yawizanukam Praise it. The name means City of Angels, Great City of Immortals, The Magnificent City of the Nine Shams, Seat of the King, City of Royal Palaces, Home of Gods Incarnate, Erected by Visvakarman at Indra's behest. In Thai, people usually call Bangkok Krong Tap, which is the shortened version of the city's full name. The name Thailand in the Thai language is Prathat Thai, which directly translates to Land of the Free. It seems pretty up then that this country is the sole country in the whole of Southeast Asia to never have been colonized by any European nation. Considering that only very very few countries in the world have managed to escape European rule, this in itself is a huge accomplishment. Thailand is a land of temples. There are over 40,000 temples in Thailand, and more than 30,000 of them are still in active use. That's why you can practically see temples anywhere you go in Thailand. Temples play an essential role in Thai everyday life, so it's no wonder why temples are everywhere in Thailand. The first known Siamese twins were born in Thailand. Cheng and Eng Bunker, the first known conjoined twins, were born on the 11th of May 1811, in a province near Bangkok in the Kingdom of Siam, today's Thailand. The twins married two different women, who were also sisters, and each couple was parents to more than ten children. Initially, they lived together and shared a bed big enough for four but after a number of years, the two sisters began quarreling and so two separate households were established. The Siamese brothers then ended up spending three consecutive nights at each home until their death in 1874. Every year there is a festival dedicated entirely to monkeys in Thailand. In the month of November, there is an annual Lokburi Monkey Banquet that is hosted in front of Praprang Samyot Temple in the province of Lokburi. The locals invite over 600 monkeys to feast on a buffet of over 2 tons of scrumptious food that has all been lovingly prepared by the locals. The monkey's menu consists of rice, tropical fruits, salad, grilled sausages, and even ice cream. The festival is hosted out of the belief that good luck will follow from treating the furry creatures with respect. The locals also do it as a means of saying thank you to the monkeys who bring thousands of tourists to the city each year. Siamese cats are native to Thailand. While the Kingdom of Siam no longer exists, the name can still be found in many places and things, including Siamese cats. Yes, this popular cat breed originated in Thailand. It's said that there used to be 23 different types of Siamese cats. However, there are only six nowadays. In Thailand, giving a pair of Siamese cats to a bride on her wedding day is a gesture of good luck.
paying respect to the royal family is a very serious matter. In Thailand, the royal family is adored and deeply respected by its citizens and it is strictly against the law to criticize any member of the monarchy. The country has the Lee's Majesty law, which means that any disrespectful acts that are performed toward the king, queen, or royal heirs are punished with imprisonment for treason. Mother's and Father's Day in Thailand are also celebrations for the king and queen rather than for one's mother and father and are celebrated nationwide by the Thai people. All men used to become Buddhist monks. In the past, all Thai young men under the age of 20, of all social rankings, including the princes and kings, became Buddhist monks for at least a short amount of time in their lifetime. Although it was never a national requirement, from a Buddhist family, it was almost always done. Obtaining monkhood is considered to be a very blessed event and dedicating a portion of one's life to Buddhism. The orchid is the national flower of Thailand. Thailand's national flower is the orchid. If you're an exotic flower enthusiast, you'll be delighted to hear that the country is home to 1,500 different orchids. You can see this beautiful exotic flower in many places, including shopping centers, temples, markets, and festivals. They grow wild in Thailand's jungles and forests, but you may even see them growing on the side of the road.